very, very <clears throat> welcome, excuse me, to this morning's meditation practice with me, Merlin. Thank you so much for, for getting up. Um, if you are up and you are meditating live this morning with me at 6.30, thank you so, so much. And I really, really hope you enjoyed this morning's meditation. Um, this morning we're going to do a meditation based on the heart area, a meditation um, really on loving kindness. And I love this meditation because it enables us to, to start our day, or if you're not doing it live and you're doing it later tonight, to close down your day with more gratitude in your heart, more acceptance, more appreciation for what is and it enables us to kind of get a fresher perspective and look through life through a different lens. And I think one of the biggest game changers for us as human beings in life is when we can pause before we react. When we can, instead of going into our own story, making things personally, we take a moment to reflect and we create a gap between what's actually happening and our response. And it enables us to maybe come out of our own story and allow ourselves to maybe walk in the shoes of somebody else. So if there's a challenging situation, something going on in your life that's maybe unwanted perhaps, it just allows you to maybe look through this different lens and observe it from the other person's point of view. And I think the biggest thing in life, if we want to have more inner ease, more inner peace, contentment, is when we allow ourselves not to get attached, not to strive, not to try and control everything, and surrender sometimes to, to surrender to what is, and know that everything is happening, unfolding as it should in this moment. And even in the darkest or most challenging times that often there is a lesson, there's an opportunity for growth, there is potentially a learning. And every experience is, a, is a, an opportunity and a blessing for us to repair something so that we don't possibly repeat it again in the future. So today's meditation we're going to work into the heart area so that we can cultivate our day to day, going about it from a more centered, grounded place, a more loving heart, a heart of gratitude, and a heart of understanding and compassion for ourselves and for everybody that we meet in the world today. So get nice and comfortable, closing down the eyes, letting the shoulders drop down and away from the ears, letting your hands just melt down onto your lap if you're in a seated position or on the floor if you're lying down. Slightly dip the chin to elongate the spine and the neck. And for the purpose of today's meditation, if it's comfortable, having the palms facing upwards in an open, receptive position. We're gonna begin the meditation by just becoming aware of your breath. So without trying to force it, change it, resist it, just becoming aware of that beautiful, soft, life-affirming breath in through the nose. And exhale, softening the body, softening the mind. Inviting you to take three slow, cleansing, chest rise, let the heart fill up with this oxygen, breathe into the back of the heart, let it fill, expand, create space, and on your 
exhale, you're just dropping down, releasing, surrendering, letting. Letting the whole body now soften and relax, releasing any tension that might have built up throughout the night. Any worries, fears, anxieties, doubts, just sending them out into the world on your exhalation. Breathe them out. And on your next in-breath, I really want you to bring your awareness to the heart center area, Anahata. And as you breathe in, filling up this area around the heart, letting it expand, letting it fill with this beautiful nourishing breath. And as you exhale, just allowing all of the muscles, the tissues, the glands to soften around this area. I'd like you to Bring into your mind's eye this morning somebody that you love. It can be anybody in your life right now. It can be somebody who potentially is no longer with us. It can be a pet. It can be anybody. Somebody that you love. I'd like you to let the following words, mantras, affirmations just wash through your body and send them to this loving person. May they be happy. May they be healthy. May they be free from suffering. May they know peace. May they be happy. May they be healthy. May they be free from suffering. And may they know peace. May they be happy. be safe and free from suffering. May they know peace. Taking a nice slow deep breath in. And exhale. And then just gently Removing the image of this loved one and we're going to place another image into our mind's eye and this time it's bringing into your mind's eye somebody that you don't really know. Somebody maybe that's just a neutrality to you. Maybe you don't even know their name. Maybe it's somebody who works in a, a coffee shop. Maybe it's someone you've seen on the bus. Maybe it's someone you just know through online. this person into your mind's eye. May they be happy. May they be healthy. May they be free from suffering. And may they know peace. be healthy and well. May they be free from angst or suffering. May they know peace. May they be happy. May they be healthy and well in mind and body. 
may they feel safe in this world and free from suffering. May they be blessed with peace. Take a nice slow deep breath in through the nose. Exhale, letting go. And then removing this image of that person and placing into your mind's eye this time all beings. Placing into your mind's eye potentially somebody who you've had a challenging time with, somebody who you have potentially maybe don't even speak to, maybe it's someone you've had an argument with, maybe it's someone that you're angry with, you're frustrated with, maybe you're jealous of, somebody who challenges you, bringing that person into your mind's eye right now. Taking a deep breath in. May they be healthy. May they be happy. May they be free from suffering. And may they know peace. May they be healthy. May they be happy and content. May they feel safe in this world and free from anger and suffering. And may they know peace in mind as well as body. May they be healthy. May they be well. May they be free from suffering. May they know peace. Deep breath in, filling up the heart area, letting it expand, letting it feel open and receptive. And then lastly, bringing into your mind's eye your very own self. Sending this love and compassion from your heart back deeply into the very essence of who you are, reconnecting to your soul, reconnecting to your true self. May I be happy. May I be well. May I be free from suffering. May I be blessed with May I be healthy. May I be happy. May I feel safe in this world and free from suffering. May I know peace in my heart. May I be happy. May I be healthy and well. May I be safe and free from suffering. May I know peace. Take a nice, slow, deep cleansing breath in through the nose. Let your belly rise, let your heart rise, let your whole body expand with this breath. And exhale, softening, softening. Taking your hands to your heart, at the center of the heart center of the body, bowing your head in gratitude for this morning's breath. May you go about your, today, your day today with a heart filled with love and compassion and kindness. May you send this love to all beings and all people you meet, known and unknown. And may you send this love back to yourself, through your thoughts, through the words that you use, through the conversations you hold, through the food that you eat, the beverages that you drink, the movement you get, 
through all that you do and all that you say today. May you be blessed. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. I hope you've enjoyed this practice. May you have a beautiful day. Namaste.